here we have the Mac. Uh, it's a 2.16 gigahertz with one gig of RAM and 250 gig hard drive. As I said in seals, it has been partitioned. Uh, one side runs Mac, the other will be on Windows, which I will demonstrate shortly. As you can see, it boots up fine, no problems whatsoever. Let's just run some of the programs just to demonstrate. As I said, pre-installed is InDesign, CS4, Photoshop, CS4, Illustrator, CS4, Flash, Dreamweaver, we have Acrobat Pro, Cork Express, Word, Office 2008, all installed with updates for Safari, Firefox, iMovie, i Photo, iTunes, all of that already pre-installed for you. Let me just demonstrate Photoshop CS4 just to show you and prove to you that it actually works. We have Photoshop all loaded up. Everything's there. Quit. Show you also in design CS4. You might be able to hear in the background that, as I said in the sale, the left fan uh, is constantly on, but it might be quite a simple fix with the SMC system management protocols. That's quite easily sorted. Apparently, I've, I've Googled for that, and it should be quite a simple fix. There you go, in Design CS4. Uh, asking if I if I want a survey, I'll just say no, thank you very much. As you can see, running perfect. Uh, let me bring you up here about this map. Zoom in a bit, two seconds. Operating system 10.4 is a 2 gig core dual, more than full. Let's just scroll across. Two gig number of cores is two, and it will be installed with one gig of memory. Uh, just to show you, also to prove you that this Mac has been turned on. It is today is Thursday, 18th of June, 2009. Quarter past, just after quarter past seven. So, that shows everything is working fine. Zoom out. Also, I'd like to show you the machine working in Windows. And for this, you could start up disk, click on Windows, and then restart. It's been loaded with Windows XP, and that is Windows XP Pro. And I've put in OpenOffice, which does basically the same job as Microsoft Office. Uh, some may even say it does a better job. I've also installed Avast Antivirus and also Adware 2007, I believe it is, or maybe 2008, I can't remember. And that basically gets rid of any Trojans or Spyware. And also Windows Defender has been installed as well. So you have basically three antivirus software that is installed. And the moment you release, when you, moment you get a Mac, uh, you just need to switch it on, and that's it working. Let's move forward to the startup. You might notice it's slightly different than what theme that you have in your XP. It's just basically, I've changed it to this particular theme. Uh, it can be easily reverted back to the original green and blue sky if you uh, would want that.
but uh, just slightly different as always. There we have it. Because it runs natively, it's not an emulation software, so it is actually working straight from the actual processor itself. Let's come to that. See, internet is working fine. The wireless is working fine. And here you have the eBay homepage. So as you can see, the machine is working fine. Today being Thursday, and it's shown it's working Let's go to the control panels. And let me show you the system. I'll zoom into that so you can see it. Running Service Pack 2, that can be easily updated. 2 GHz computer running. Uh, but one gig of RAM it will be eventually. Let me just zoom out. Show you back, boot back in Mac mode, and start. And of course included will be the aluminium keyboard and there will be a Mac mouse included also. And being a fresh machine, it's, uh, it boots up really quick. By my calculations, less than 30 seconds. There you go. And that's it. That's it, folks. Hope you like it. Crack a machine.